Hey Pisces, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali, aka Owl Tarot, and I'm here to give you guys your weekly reading. We're gonna tap into this energy, see what's coming towards you this week. But before we get started, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell so you'll be notified when I post a new reading. If you are a returning subscriber, guys, thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. As you all know, my readings are for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. These are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. There is no gender in tarot. Please reverse the rules as need be. Cross watchers, you're always welcome. Guys, don't forget to check uh, check your other placements to so get a better understanding of this energy. And if you would like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. Let's get started here. What are the overall messages for Pisces this week, universe? Overall messages for Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Science, Pisces. Overall messages. Too many. Let's take this first one. Trust the process. Everything always works out. Something better is on the horizon. Have total confidence in the universe and gratitude. Oh, two of them. Got it. Alrighty. So let's see here. The next one is gratitude. Gratitude increases attraction and opportunities. Little things count. Be grateful for all of your life. Awesome. Okay, so there's the trust the process. Things are getting ready to change here for you, Pisces. And let's see here. What else? Love where you are. Appreciate current circumstances. Ask yourself why you want what you want. See the beauty in it all. Okay. Alrighty, Pisces. I feel that for a lot of my Pisces that I'm talking to here, you guys have really been working on yourself. For some of you guys, you've been getting over some heartache, some hard situations here. Like you, you've been trusting the process. You've been working on yourself. You've been healing yourself. You've been trying to obtain peace, serenity, you know, all of the above. Things have been hard for you. And finally, Things are starting to work out. You've been trusting the process. And before you know it, everything that you have been hoping and praying for will be, be here. Okay? <clears throat> so start being grateful for it. Even though you don't see it coming to the light right now. Even though you don't see it in, in your face. Just be grateful for it because it's on its way. And love where you're at. You're in a good place in life right now. Like I feel for a lot of you guys. You guys have broken free from toxicity. From addictions. For... From toxic people, places, and things. And enjoy this because you're in a real good place. You worked really, really hard to get to where you're at today, Pisces. And enjoy your process. It's been a hard one, but enjoy it. Okay? You got the two of wands here. There's some clarity. There's something that's coming through for you here with the two of wands. Okay? I feel that for a while you felt like your path was blocked. Or for some of you guys, you, like I said, you, you've been praying, hoping, manifesting something someone's returned possibly and you you haven't seen any forward movement but with this two of wands there's gonna there's gonna get ready to be movement here things are gonna start changing here there's a path that's gonna be enlightened for somebody here and if you're a pisces and you are um manifesting the return of your partner well guess what here they are here goes your emperor your emperor your empress remember there's no gender in tarot you guys have been manifesting someone's return and this person's about to be enlightened. Before you know it, this person will be back around. With the Ten of Swords here, there is a there's an ending to a painful situation here for you, Pisces. You've been through a lot with a situation in a relationship within your personal life, and that's coming to an end. Okay. You got a king of wands coming in here. Someone who's very sexy, vibrant, charismatic. This person's coming in here very passionately. This person could have been the cause of the reason why you've been going through that Ten of Swords. And they're coming back in here. With the page, with the Princess of Swords here, I feel that this person keeps an eye on you. Like every so often, this person will go into your social medias or go into your pictures and just pretty much stare at you, look at you, see how beautiful you are, how sexy you are, the good old times. Like, don't think about all the good old times that they had with you. What else, universe? Oh, I got two of them here. Princess of Pentacles. Somebody's coming towards you to offer a uh, office to offer some uh to offer to make an offer towards you, okay? And you're gonna be in this two of swords energy. You're gonna be a little bit indecisive. 
because you're not sure if you should trust this person okay someone's coming in here to make an offer if you're accustomed to receiving flowers from this person they'll be coming with a gift in hand i'm hearing peace offering but overall you're, they're asking you to make a decision here and with the hermit here this person has gone within you have gone within there's a lot of healing there's a lot of meditation here there's a lot of clarity that's being had and this person's coming in here like finally this person sees the the, the path they see the light at the end of the tunnel they want to come towards you with the moon here, <clears throat> this person's coming towards you to, to relay some information. There's some things that this person has yet to, to confess, maybe. Or just some things that they have to let you know. And this person's ready to talk. I feel this person's ready to open up, Pisces, and let you know what's really been going on. What else, universe? Four of Wands. This is your twin flame. This is your divine partner. You're getting ready to celebrate. Celebrate someone's homecoming. There's going to be a lot of things to celebrate here. A family reunion. A reconciliation. A homecoming. Like some, something is getting ready to be celebrated here. And with the Two of Pentacles, I think that you've been working for this. Okay? You've been working really hard. You've been really focusing on yourself. Focusing on your stability. Focusing on your personal growth. And finally, you're starting to see the fruits of your labor. There's something that's going to make you happy. Right now, like I, like I said, you may not see this growth just yet. But like Universe told you, love where you're at. Because before you know it, everything that you've been hoping and praying for is going to come towards you. And it's going to make you happy. Right now, you may feel a little bit down. You may feel like things aren't changing. But they are. Things are getting ready to change for you. You just don't see it just yet. Prince of Cup here, which is the Knight of Cups. Someone's coming in here to offer you an apology, okay? Someone owes you an apology, and they're coming in to offer that apology. They're coming in here to speak a truth. Queen of Wands. This person sees you very vibrant, very sexy. You got the King and the Queen of Wands here. This is a, this is a couple that has a lot of passion for each other. You and the person that we're currently talking about, you guys have a lot of passion for each other. You find each other very alluring very attractive like when you guys go out together all eyes on you you guys are that couple that a beautiful couple okay that people can become envious because you guys just look sexy together is what i'm getting ten of pentacles in the reverse if somebody walked away from you in the past and I, what i mean walked away like physically moved out okay physically grabbed all their stuff and relocated well guess what this person's on their way back pisces Somebody wants to be able to rebuild this stability with you. What else, universe? And the Empress, power couple, baby. This is a power couple. Your person is getting ready to come back. This person and you were in a higher level commitment. If you guys weren't married, you were thinking about marriage. You were thinking about a higher level commitment here. And this person is coming back to offer that. This person is coming back to offer that higher level commitment that they once offered before. Well, now they're coming back because everything is renewed. This person has gone within. This person sees the truth of the matter. And they're coming in here for a higher level commitment. This person has a lot of love for you, Pisces. There is a cycle that has yet to be closed with you and this person, but they're coming in here with judgment, the clarity. They're coming in here with the whole truth and nothing but the truth. They want to bring this connection in from out of the cold, Pisces, okay? In from out of the cold. So someone's coming back because they want reconciliation. They see things clearly now. They know who they want to be with, Pisces, and ultimately, at the end of the day, they want to be with you. So prepare yourself. Prepare yourself and trust this process because everything is working out for you in divine timing, okay? All right, guys, I hope and pray that this reading gave you clarity. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you want to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.